Hey everybody, car racers, we welcome. We're gonna do the uh, Don Russ uh, half case number three, Rip City Card style, right now. Come this way. Mandy, you are awesome. Awesome. Special extra awesome. So says Abraham. Okay. So let's get nine boxes of this stuff out. One, two, three. Four, five. Seven, eight, and nine. It is, it is nine, right? It's an eighteen box case. Nine divided by two. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. We got this. We got this. All right. Do we want to pack stack it all, or do we not? Do we want to pack stack it all, or do we not? I think we're gonna pack stack it all. I think we think we have to. Well, as she should, Alan, because not only is she awesome, but she is extra awesome, and Abraham has said so. How did you hustle your wife into this, though? I mean, of all things to, like, force her to look at, you're going to choose Donruss football? I mean, are you just, like, starting, like, harsh with her? Because this is not an easy one. This is not an easy one to uh, be part of. If I can get it done in an hour and a half, I will be obscenely happy with myself. But odds are even low on that. You know, like, I don't know, an Inception baseball or something? A nice, easy 15-minute break, maybe? But no, I mean, you know, whatever. whatever. You If you want to start it hard, then... This is the one to do it with. You know what? If you can be happy with your lady and your lady be happy with you doing anything, like then that, to me, is special. You know? I mean, like, the lady and I watch uh, Murder, She Wrote, you know, on TiVo uh, in bed together. Like, that's, like, some of our just, like, quiet time together kind of deal so I mean if yours is watching a movie's worth of uh, Don Russ football then more power to you and, and I appreciate it I it's just so I mean I, don't, I mean again I mean if it was tops like if it was tops, it would it would be like so much easier. We could I, I could have it ripped through in fifteen minutes at maximum. But Panini does not. God dang it! Panini does not want to make it uh, easy on me, and you know that's that's their business. Yeah. Unparalleled on Wednesday. Unparalleled comes out on Wednesday. Get okay. Okay. Just stop with that. Let's just stop with that. So this is all we have to open. No big deal. No biggie. No biggie. I'm a professional. So let's 
make this happen. Let's actually close this knife up before I stab myself with it. I don't know. I wish we, I, I wish, I hope, I'm hoping one day that we will move like into a retail spot. Because as much as I dislike like retail customers kind of in general, I think it would be fun to have a, like an LCS with like people coming in to open stuff. Because like when I was in, uh, in Tokyo, like that was like the most time that I'd ever spent like in an LCS was with uh, the guy Kazu, and you know I mean he had like a bunch of people that would come in and just hang out and they would just like sit around a table and open boxes and just chill and chat you know like much much like we are now except you know in person I do have an oddball break uh, tonight. Like my last one tonight is uh, Victory Lane Racing. Sorters are going to be wicked mad about that one, but I have held off on classics for a, a couple of days, so maybe they won't be like hyper angry. Yeah, see, I don't know. Packs I have, like, issue with. Like, I don't... I really only ever want to open boxes. Packs, like, I don't know. I just feel like there's, like, too much... Too much chance for nothing. But, I mean, we've even, like, kind of scouted, like, a little... You know, like, potentially a spot down here. We had looked into it like early on, like in this building, but it just, just did not work out. But I mean, if we did that, we could start breaking like upper deck hockey, like the, the new fancy upper deck hockey. Even even without me knowing anything about it. And I mean, there is a card shop, like, literally across the street from us. But, my God, they were expensive. And, and I mean, I know it's, like, it costs, like, more money to have, like, a, like a physical space. Because, I mean, I know rent's higher, insurance, I mean, there's a, a lot of factors. I know, I get there's a, a lot of factors to it. But, I mean, dang, they were, they were charging heavy for, uh... Like, I think at the time, I was looking at, like, uh, 17 draft packs they were selling. And, like, the, like the 17 draft jumbos were, like, a bad, like a bad product to sell pack-wise anyway. Because, like, the autographs were always in one spot. Like, like, you knew exactly which pack had the autographs in them. I think it was 17 draft. Hmm... Whichever one. Well, I mean, Alan, if you like nice things, if you like nice things, then yeah. I, I mean, I guess that's okay. I mean, have you uh, have you tried taking her to a casino to uh, to hook you up there too? Or does Mandy go to the casino by herself, hook herself up with her uh, hot hand, and then just like throw you like a little bit of uh, side action, and be like, yeah, 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 
I get you something nice from the uh, car shop, you know, if you, uh, you know, wash all the dishes this week. That's what I would do if I, if I had Mandy's hot hand, I think. I would put you to work. <laughs> I, you know, I've never been, like, a gambler myself. Like, oddly enough, like, only vice that I never got to, never got really into was the casino, so. It's probably better. Although, I think breaking at a casino would be, like, the best, like, best possible thing. Like, just set up a table. Do some like high end boxes. Have somebody else else there with uh, like cash willing to uh, buy out hits. You know, if they wanted to sell them at you know at, at whatever price and uh, just rinse and repeat. Halfway through, I guess. Almost halfway, maybe. Cards per pack, 400 packs per box. Uh, it is nine by six. We have like 13,000 cards here. I think something like something about that. Ah, come on, come on.
I'm going to welcome tomorrow off. I'll tell you that right now. I have to get another case of Donruss in the store for Jesse to uh, fill and break. I don't know. We are have we have been like bantering about a little bit about uh, like changing like schedules a little bit around and like Jesse and I like working together. Like at nights cuz we seem to do kind of well like with each other. Like we, you know, we play off of each other well. But it would mean us like being dark two days a week if we did that. So like I don't know. And like I'm not like uber hyped about like working until like three o'clock in the morning every night either. Like Jesse does. But. It is something that we are considering. this room I wonder if we could have like two channels like if there could be like a Rift City Cards 1 and a Rift City Cards 2 because like if we started something like of this nature shift it to like channel 2 you know that we like like Break, you know, longer breaks live on channel two. Trying to, you know, sell stuff more on channel one. Shorter breaks. Mm. Might be something to consider. Brandon, I am almost done opening all the packs, but yes, uh, it's going to be very hard for you to do it. It is taking everything that I have to uh, do it myself.
Like, if I did not have, like, more mental fortitude, I would just say, like, oh, my God, you know, so I lost the key to the cage that's got the Donruss in it. We're going to do this tomorrow when Jesse, uh, you know, was doing it. But it is what it is, yeah. Listen, I mean, frankly, it's going to be this and then probably eBay breaks after this. Because it, it, it took me an hour and 45 minutes to open it yesterday. I might be able to get through it a little bit faster today, but the odds are, odds are low. Yeah, I gotta see if uh, we can have like multiple live streaming channels like on uh, on our one thing. Like maybe just have you know Jesse do anything. Well, do I mean eh. for the amount of time it takes to open, it's almost not worth the dollars that are coming in. Like I'm gonna see if Gelf can move a whole bunch of it. Maybe tomorrow or no Monday. Sweet sassy molassy. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright, it's open. It's all open. Drink of water. Oof. Alan, I like the conversation. Just like once I start opening those packs, like it's just like everybody dies. Like I wonder, like if anybody, like even you know, like I, I often wonder, like when I'm opening something like a Don Russ, if like the rapture has occurred, because before we open it, people are just chatting and you know talking back and forth and everything, and then as soon as I start opening packs, it is like dead silence on the chat. Everybody dips. Everybody's like, I am not sitting the hell through this. I get it. I, you know, I wouldn't either. You know, go check out something else. Like, but I mean, damn. All right, I need just one second to. gather myself here okay what do we got what do we got do we little Scott to 99 Jameis Winston, Leather Kings, Swatch. Let me grab my, my sleeves over this way. Uh, to you, 99. Buccaneers for Chris Fitz. It's these that piss me off more than anything. Like these unnecessary, like, flipped cards. Because they just slow everything down. Well, yeah, and I got chewed out for it, too. To 31, LaDainian Tomlinson. Like, not being focused enough on the uh, on the breaks and the cards and stuff. So, I'm going to try and keep this one professional. For the most part. Uh... 
Fans of the game, James Kahn is a Cowboys fan. Loser. One day I'm going to have my own fans of the game card for the Bucks. It's going to be a huge short print and it's going to be highly, highly in demand. Highly in demand, I tell you. I mean, mercifully, the stuff is like mostly sorted out evenly. So that, I mean, if it if it wasn't, it would be so much worse. But at this point, it's just a lot of cards. Randall Cobb to ninety nine. Alex Collins to 34. Uh, Foles to a Hyundai. And Stack one of thirty seven shall be uh, done with. Jordan Howard autograph for the Bears at ten. Two D Ace. As well, just start moving stuff around. No, listen, Alan. I, I don't know. Whatever. I'm. I'm here. I'm an open book for you guys. If you know. I'm happy to chat and talk about anything that's uh, anything you guys want to or anything that can help in any way. Demarius Thomas to 99. So many cards. So many cards. Thank you, Terry. Uh, Sheriff to 75. So many sweet, sweet, lovely cards. I mean, how could you not love them? You would have to be a fool to uh, not love them. An absolute fool. A gory damn fool, for that matter. Uh, 
Henry to 50. A Bosa Swatch to 150 for the uh, Chargers. A Kamara Autograph Elite Series of 25 for the Saints. Got that going for you. Uh, Oliver Vernon to a hundy. Derwin James. Aqueous test for uh, Aguilar. And uh, stack number two sees itself no mas. There's seriously only one, two, three, four, five, six. Only seven more stacks left to go. Only seven more. Throw a couple of these away. McCown is 25 for the Jets. I still think I should sell these kids reporters cards. Another Winston patch, 25 this time, three color. I should have been saving them and selling them off to somebody. But I didn't. But I didn't. I mean, maybe somebody, you know, one of you guys could have gone to the uh, Super Bowl with your kid and maybe gotten me, like, you know, some swag or something. Like, a, you know, a little something something for the effort. Joku press proof yeah. and I'm hoping everybody just like sends all these uh, rated rookies into PSA and just gets tens on them and then uh, a Cameron Jordan 75 then just sells them for ridiculous dollars tube Colts fan, uh, yeah, I, uh, that, yeah, that, that's a hard one. 
I mean, I have nothing against Andrew Luck. So, like, I I mean, I hope that, like, he comes back. Uh, Zach Martin, 200. And that uh, you guys can, like, actually protect him a little bit. You know, just just protect him like a little bit, just a little bit. You know, don't don't get him blasted like you know every other every other uh, snap. Uh, Greg Olson, one twenty five. Oliver to 75 die cut. A uh, John Kelly aqueous test rated rookie. Well, I mean, who else do you guys have wide receiver wise? Brandon? I mean, you got to uh, didn't didn't you get a didn't you get Brandon Marshall? Sean McCoy to uh, two eighty seven. Uh, T.Y. Hilton, yeah. A uh, Wagner Aqueous Test. Well, I mean, listen, you, you've got a gap, you know, in there for, uh, for a receiver, so. I mean, the only thing, like, most receivers, it seems, like, takes, like, a, you know, like, a year or two to get them, like, properly, you know, integrated, so. Hopefully he learns quickly. Take Baldwin to 100. Got the uh, Switzer to one fifty. Well, do I heard the Browns like, or, or I heard Dez say like, "Oh, I'd even go," you know, "I'd go to the Browns," and the Browns were like, "Dude, we asked you like in like to come in like six weeks ago, and you like you didn't do it." Like, so I don't know what the hell is up with Dez. Oxen two hundred. See, that's Dickery. I mean, listen, Des Bryant's not a Michelle autograph patch style to uh, ninety nine. I mean, I don't, I don't know who he thinks he is exactly. I don't know who he thinks he is exactly, but I mean, he is not uh, commanding the dollar that 
he thinks he's going to get. Like, I mean, he's a two on an average team, a three on a good one. Conklin uh, to uh, 83. Like, I mean, he, I don't know. He, I feel like he needs to be happy with the money that he got and just get on a team and suck it up and get paid. No. I mean, Terry, uh, of course not. I mean, that, that brave words, exactly. He's not the dads of three or four years ago. Like, he's... He ain't, he ain't that good anymore. Possession receiver at best. And even then, like, I mean, it, you know, if he goes and, like, cops a huge attitude, you know, with not getting targets and balls and stuff, then, you know, then you're just stuck with somebody that's, uh, that's just on the sideline bitching, the, like, the whole time. So, I mean, I'm not surprised that there aren't, like, teams falling over themselves to, uh, to sign him to, uh, $400 Shannon Jeffrey. Yeah, I mean, just listen, but staying out of trouble isn't enough anymore. There's a lot of young guys that, like, you know, basically stay out of trouble. Like, but to have, I mean, do you do you want some, like, old man who's not even the best wide receiver on your team, like, not even the second best wide receiver on your team, just, like, sitting beside the quarterback, like, while the defense plays, just yelling at him, about how, you know, oh, on that last play, I, I had that guy beat. Why didn't you, you throw me the ball? Like, I, I don't know. He's not good enough to deal with. But he's, he doesn't even have Terrell Owens, like, ability. That's the other thing. Like, I mean, if he had, like, Owens' skills... That like might be a different situation, but he is like I mean not even close to as good as Owens. No, no, he is not even close. Even at this point in their careers, he's no, he ain't, he ain't even close to To. Brave words, I agree. I agree. Sean Alexander, Seahawks autograph to 10. Keyshawn is a guy, to me, Alan is a closer, uh, a closer thing. To me, Keyshawn is is a closer comparison. I think Keyshawn was better, but it's it's closer than To. I mean, you know, like all Keyshawn, you know, all Keyshawn did. Well, Keyshawn talked way too much. Uh, to nineteen, a gala day. But you know, like Brave Words said, they like there are better there are better options that will put in more work and get you the same yards with less hassle.
Uh, the 400 Derrick Henry. I mean, Keyshawn talk way too much. And I mean, listen, Keyshawn was a Buccaneer, so I, so I, so I do love him. But man, I mean, that guy could just. I mean, he 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 was as good about complaining about not getting the ball as he was catching the ball, and he was good at catching the ball. Yeah, I mean, it's something if, like, you know, if the Cowboys even say, like, you know, you know, we, you know, we don't want the hassle. Uh, Matty Ice to 100. I don't know. I seriously don't. I mean, I don't know who, who he's going to, who he'll end up with. I mean he I mean he very well may sit until until a team loses somebody to injury. Like I don't I I I am not even sure that he makes it into somebody's camp. Hey John Kelly to twenty five die cut. AJ Green Swatchery for the Bengals to 125. I know, Brave Words. That's what I'm saying. Like, they didn't like trying to restructure a contract, anything like that. They were just like, see ya. You know, get, you know give us a, uh, you know, maybe you'll get our Christmas card kind of thing, but uh, don't, you know, don't look back. An eye for 200. I mean, and again, I don't think he's bad, but I think he's just like a number, a number two or a number three that should just be quiet and and you know, catch balls in the middle. And I mean, listen, I am basically like an NFL coach, uh, you know, of uh, you know of knowledge. Joey Bosa aqueous test. You know, I I am a near expert in all things uh, quarterback foot or uh, armchair football related. Near expert. Well, dude, I mean the I mean the Browns like I mean damn that I mean that's that's that that dumbass Callaway. Uh, have have they decided are they are they are they going to suspend him or not for getting pulled over with weed? I mean I know I know that he says it was not his and he had borrowed a friend's car kind of thing, but like, are they going to have like Gordon and, and, and is Callaway going to be able to play or no? Well, I know Callaway played, and I know he played well, but will he be? A, I mean, is the league going to suspend him? I don't know what it is about Florida, Florida Gator football and weed, but damn, they just uh, they do not mix well. Uh, two Winston patches, Chris Fitz. No autos as of yet. Two Winston patches.
We've actually been uh, discussing Des Bryant. And whether like he should be, you know, on a team. Or if he just needs to shut his pie hole and uh do something else. No. Chris Fitz, sell him, man. Sell him, get some dollars. Like I don't I, I don't so uh, any more I've gotten like very like not I mean like that very but like this you know. Uh, the wife okay, frankly the wife is bitching about uh about my cards. She's complaining that I got too many of them. I don't even have that many. But a Gasecki for the Dolphins? Apparently she doesn't like that I hide them in like seven places in the house. There's like a closet that I have like a little box of stuff there. Then there's like some in the bedroom that have like, like my most specialist cards. Then like over by the... Uh, uh, in like one part of the entertainment cabinet, there's another box over there, and she was like looking around the other day, like, "What's this? What's that? I mean, it ain't nothing, baby. It ain't nothing. Just you know, don't sweat it." But she's sweating it. And happy wife, happy life. A Christian McCaffrey to 25 Panthers autograph. Ground force style. Some Panthers fanciness. More of it, autograph wise even. That should make some people happy. To uh, 29 to Chase Edmonds. Garcon to 100. Uh, Frank, honestly, probably not, if I'm, if I'm going to be honest with you. Um, I mean, I got, I got an Elements full case in the store. I've got a Donruss half case. Both have, need a little bit of work done to them. So, nothing that is, like, super close, but things with wonderful prices it will be filled in the next uh, day, probably, if you uh, were interested in uh, jumping in on them. But uh, I don't think anything that's going to go tonight. Hey, Walter Payton, 200 If you are interested, you get $15 off your first purchase of $25. Though, if you uh, go to ripcitycards.com, go to login, go to register... Register, we kick you back an email with a, a discount code that you use in the cart before checkout. So, I mean, it might be worth taking a, taking a little shot if you're willing to uh, wait like a day or so. Football has been strong so far uh, in the room the past couple of days, so I expect uh, most things moving pretty quickly. Ah, Frank. So, so, so put in a new email, man. Make yourself a new email. You got to have like one for work or something. Get yourself a double deal. Get yourself a double deal and uh, get get in on something else. But no, if I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't. I don't think any other football is gonna fill tonight. Jesse will. I mean, Jesse will definitely fill a couple tomorrow. 
You got to uh, to leave the twenty five. But tonight, probably not. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you. Well, Frank, I appreciate that. I, I appreciate the honesty. For that alone, Frank, the next time I see your name involved in a break, I will use my very powerful uh, focus to pull you something extra fancy. I will I will do that for you. All right. 3 War stacks. Trace moss. Let's see, what we got. Many fun things so far. Many, many fun things so far. Well, your wife's PC, PC should be getting strong. That is the that is the ultimate judge of a man and a woman, their PC. Conrad, how are you doing tonight? Jimmy Graham to 80. You know, I don't care how much money you have. I don't care if you live in a house or if you're homeless. Or if you're uh, living with your parents or whatever, it's your PC is uh, what you should be judged upon. I don't think there's anybody that'll disagree with me on that one. Well, this one's right on top, so I go and yank this one out of Kareem Hunt for the Chiefs. Jimmy Gr Jimmy Graham's name literally translates to condom for a cracker. That's a condom for a cracker. Hmm. Fair trade to me, uh, Red Dragon fair trade to me i mean i if i was in well well wait well no maybe no it needs to be the other way around i would give up a cracker for a condom but i don't know that i would give up a condom for a cracker unless it is like a you know like it is is it a handful of uh, like oyster crackers you know because like i'm not gonna give up for one oyster cracker but maybe like a solid handful of oyster crackers maybe I don't know. Definitely not any of those those absolute trash, like lightly salted Ritz crackers. Have you guys had those things? Pure junk. Don't lightly salt my cracker. Don't do it. A Vander Esch, Aqueous rookie for the uh, Cowboys. I'm sick of these people trying to tell me uh, how, how much salt I should be shoving down my throat. If I want all the salt, I'm gonna, I, you know, if I don't want, if I don't want all the salt in the cracker, then I will wipe it off. But don't try and sell me or my wife 
uh, you know, some half salted piece of trash, you know, that I'm gonna that I'm gonna shove peanut butter, Nutella, and honey on. Don't do it. The Frank Gore to fifty. Okay, that was all right. That might have gotten out of control a little bit. I apologize. James Washington Steelers to uh, four ninety nine. That complaint has been uh, has been festering too long. My my apologies. Marquez uh, Valdez Scantling to uh, eighty three. Stupid half salted crackers. I mean, just I mean, really, bro. Why don't Why don't I just eat dirt? Why don't I just eat dirt? Well, I make them for the wife, Alan. I'm not uh, not a huge Nutella fan myself, but uh, I will occasionally make her a Ritz cracker, like one Ritz cracker with peanut butter on it, one Ritz cracker with a little bit of Nutella on it, and make a sandwich out of it, and then give it to her for a treat. I'm just as happy to uh, eat with j just the uh, just the cracker with nothing. Oh no, they're going to charge you more, Red Dragon. They're going to charge you more. That's part of the scam. They're going to charge you 25% more to use 50% less materials. The industrial machine trying to uh, scam us out of our fair share of salt. She likes it, Alan. And it's like, I don't know, every two weeks, maybe every month, you know, I'll, I'll do it for her. She likes it. So, you know. All right, two more. J hi hi to twenty-five. The uh, Brandon Cooks swat tree to uh, ninety-nine. Red Dragon, how you been doing lately? It's been a little while since I've se since I've seen you. Since I've had the Genuine pleasure. Speak with you. Cooks in ninety nine. I met the like a guy at the National who runs like some Facebook group that is like dedicated to uh, like rooting out scammers and stuff. I don't know. I don't really want to want to go on his website because I, I don't want people to think I think I'm a scammer. I don't know one. I don't know one day I may just have to like. Make a make a, a Cooks ninety nine happen. Uh, Dante Pettis Niners to uh, four ninety nine. Like do it, you know. Make it look all super sketchy so that everybody like you know is talking about it. But then like a miraculously show like a third camera angle or something that shows that there was like nothing going on, so that we get like the press for it. But then uh, you know we get like all cleared. I don't know. I mean, I I think dra I mean, I think Chrome might be like pretty fancy. 
I mean, there are a lot of uh, a lot of folks that could have nice Chrome cards. You know, Blue Jays, Yankees, McKinnon uh, to uh, four hundred. There are several teams with with some uh, prospecty type folks that might that might be in there. I'm be curious. I'm going to be curious. Gronk seventy five. I mean, you got to do something in between Chrome and Draft. I mean, Draft is like six months away almost. You can't do nothing in between. I think I mean I definitely think that you could sit down and put together like a small list of it. But I mean, we'll see. I uh, see. I don't know. It, it, that's because I mean, let's be honest. The, the the tops Chrome Auto Checklist was soft. Like it, I mean, it was very soft. What about so? Uh, what's his name? Uh, the the Blue Jays guy. Dude, my oh my brain, this, this Donruss is melting my brain. Vlad. Vlad, Florial. Oh, honey. I mean, that's at least four decent teams. I mean, and if you can if you can spread the dollars among the top like top five or something, if we if I could get five decent teams, Braves got to have somebody in there too. Braves always have somebody good. Do you know Atkins ninety seven? No, I think they definitely put put Vlad in it. I, I think they definitely, after not putting them in uh, in Topps Chrome, I think you 100% have an autograph in it. Joe Thomas. To 125. I don't know. I mean, in the end, does it even matter? I mean, ex I mean, except for somebody like you. I mean, because e even as like as relatively soft as the Chrome checklist has been, it's been like it's been smoothly selling. eBay loves it. eBay absolutely loves it. Matthias, you think you think will be in it, KG Fowler? 
or Matthias. Matthias. True font to fifty. Ack. Knowledge is power. Ha have uh, has it gone? Has it gone out of control already? A Traquan Smith for the Saints to four ninety nine. Like I thought that it might have waited a little bit longer before it start before it started to spiral. Dante Jackson uh, to seventy five. Luck to a hundred. Thielen. Look at Red Dragon do, like doing double work. Red Dragon is like is like an information broker. He's he, he's like all over the place. And there we have it. So it shall be done. Twenty one hundred HTA. Yeah. Alright, we've got autographs for the Traquan Smith to four ninety nine for the Saints, the Pettis to four ninety nine for the Niners, the uh, James Washington for the Steelers to four ninety nine. Got a uh, McCaffrey uh, for the uh, Panthers to twenty five. A Segedy 499 for the Dolphins, a Sean Alexander to 10 for the Seahawks, a Michelle rookie phenom patch autograph to 99 for the Patriots, a Kamara to 25 for the Saints, and a Jordan Howard to 20 and it went to 10, excuse me, for the Bears. Thank you, everybody. We'll get us right back to two. Yeah.